What's up guys? So for today's video, it's going to be a little bit different for me. It's going to be more of a vlog style video. I haven't done one of these before. I've never tried to, but these are my like favorite types of videos to watch. So I have a lot to do today. I've got some errands to run. So I figured I would, today was the best day to try to do my first vlog and um, I would bring you along with me. I have some grocery shopping to do. We have no groceries in our apartment and we are in desperate need. And I figured today would be the best day to do that because I don't have to work. I got up early, I went to the gym, started my day there, and I'm feeling good. So we're gonna go, go get some groceries. Okay, so I just pulled up here at Walmart and I'm about to go inside and start grocery shopping. But I, um, before I went in, I did want to bring up some of the apps that I talked about in my last video and show them to you, the ones that I use when I do like my grocery shopping and just shopping in general. So I'm just going to turn the camera around really quick and show you. So if you watched my last video, I talked about the cash back rewards folder that I had on my phone that I use. And I use um, Ibotta the most. It's just an app where you can get cash back on things that you purchase every day. So I would click on find offers and I've already done this. I usually try to do this before I go grocery shopping just because it's easier to like look through everything beforehand and figure out what you want to buy or what you need and I just go to find offers and I click on the store that I'm going to and then I just scroll through and the way that you pick one of the offers is you just hit the little plus button in the corner and sometimes it'll have you watch like a really short video on the product or just answer like a survey question or something um, and then it adds it to your my offers folder here and everything is stored there so it's almost like your own little list that way you don't have to like write it down separately even though I still do just because there's a lot more that I would that I'm gonna need to get that it isn't offered in the app but I really do like using this app because so like it says up here my lifetime earnings and I don't use it as often as a lot of people because you can definitely earn a lot more than I have so far but my lifetime earnings are $145 so and I just recently redeemed like 20 some to my PayPal account but yeah I just wanted to show that to you before I go in and that's kind of how there's a lot of things on there that we don't that I don't use or don't necessarily need but it's good to like find things that you already purchase and get money back on and to find things that you want to try like new things that you want to try so yeah Definitely download Ibotta if, if you want to get cash back. Okay, so filming while I was in Walmart was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be because it was super awkward. Um, like I said, I've never done that before. So anytime I would try to pull my camera out, someone of course would come down the aisle. So I would put it away, put it away really quickly. So I figured the best thing to do is to just wait until I got home and just kind of show you everything that I got. Okay, so here is everything that I got. I'll kind of just um, pick through some of the stuff and just like, show you so I just got bread I like to get the um, wheat bread just because it, it is I guess a little bit better for you and the um, 40 calorie version um, because I think that the regular loaves are like 80 calories a slice or 60 I'm not sure I just know it's less calories than normal so I always like to get that um, just some paper towels and some pasta sauce because we do eat pasta a lot and I got some of these I'm trying to eat healthier so I got some of these like fiber one snack bars I know I've gotten the um, brownie uh, something brownie before and they were pretty good but I really love lemon I like to get the lemon loaves from Starbucks or like lemon poppy seed muffins so I'm trying to do better and get the fiber one the 90 calorie versions 
Uh, just a Starbucks drink, which I shouldn't have got, but I couldn't resist. Some peanuts, some bacon pieces for salads, um, and then ranch dressing back there, and the Olive Garden Italian dressing. I love, love this dressing, but I did get the light version, so hopefully it doesn't taste too terribly different. Some strawberries, um, just a pack of gum, some hummus. I think this will be really good for, like, putting on, dipping my carrots in for just a afternoon snack or something during work when I can't get a break or and I get hungry or something. And then I did get some yogurt and honestly I just got this box because it was Scooby-Doo. I am obsessed with Scooby-Doo. Um, so hopefully it's good. It's berry and strawberry banana. And then some milk, toothpaste. This is, this toothpaste was extremely expensive but there was a rebate for it on the Ibotta and I do like to spend a little bit extra money in like toothpaste and stuff like that. I don't like to get like cheap stuff just because I have very sensitive teeth and they hurt a lot sometimes so I just like to you know spend a little extra and get the good stuff. And then these, there was a rebate on these. I usually only buy like one at a time. My husband swears that you cannot smell them and they suck, but I love these. They smell good to me and I always get the same scent, the Forever Raspberry. And I usually like put them in the bathroom or just on like our windowsill in the bedroom or something. Just some canned goods, some corn, beans, peppers and peas, kidney beans, and I think lima beans. Yeah, lima beans. And then I got some of these muscat grapes. I usually just get like the red seedless grapes, but these look pretty good. Whoops. But these look pretty good and I wanted to try them out. Some TP and some Cheez-Its. This is the Zesty Cheddar Ranch. Two of my coworkers turned me on to these. So I figured that would be a decently semi-healthy or semi-not-bad-for-you snack. Um... I think that's pretty much everything and some like some uh, meat like turkey meat whenever we do pasta I try to do turkey meat rather than ground beef just because of course it is healthier and then boneless skinless chicken breasts and then this with that was already like pre seasoned and uh, marinated and everything so I hope that's gonna be pretty good so that is everything that I got on my little grocery run Sorry that I didn't get to film it like I wanted to, but like I said, it was super awkward. Every time I tried to film, um, people would just come down the aisle that I was in and it was just really, really awkward and weird. So I just decided to, to just bring it all home and show you that way. So I hope you enjoyed this little mini haul, grocery haul, and uh, let me know what you thought. If you have some ideas for some healthy like snacks or just meals because I suck at coming up with like meals to cook so if you have any suggestions for healthy meals using like boneless skinless chicken breasts or turkey meat or stuff like that I'm not really a big like fish fan um, which I know it is really good for you but I just don't like the taste so if you have any um, ideas or any suggestions please leave them in the comments and let me know because I'm always looking for more stuff I get bored really easy with what we we fix all the time so anyway I hope you enjoyed and uh, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more and don't forget to subscribe and leave me some comments